there was a good comment on my latest video. So I thought I would toss out a little clarification or question here at the same time. And the comment reads as follows, um, quote unquote, voting does legitimize the process. What? You mean like voting in a gang rape legitimizes the process? I had to check the transcript to make sure I heard you correctly. Maybe the transcript is wrong. Um, politics is the art of taking things from your neighbor by force. It is not anything else. Using government roads is akin to eating your supper provided by your slave owner at the end of a hard day picking cotton in the hot sun. It's hardly participation. And yeah, that's, and you know, I use the example of very similar to that one of let's say you're in a concentration camp and you're locked in this cell and the guard tosses you a, a bread crust. Do you not eat it because it was purchased with tax money? Because that's how the government got their money to buy the bread? Well, that's like survival stuff. And that's, I guess, what my whole question is, is when do you throw away your principles and say, well, but common sense? And I don't know. Um, if there was an election to say, if some, some gang rapists were, to use your example, um, some gang rapists were standing there and saying, hey, look at those four gals over there. Which one do you think we ought to rape tonight? And I uh, like if I participate in it, then I'm saying, hey, it's okay for dudes to sit around and decide who they're going to rape. Well, I think none of them. So then what's the best way to get that message across? How can I do so and not get my hands dirty with, with the nastiness of it? Um, if I just turn around and say, you guys are disgusting and walk away, you know, assuming there's nothing I could actually physically do, is that better than voting for, hey, instead of taking turns raping each of the women tonight, just rape one and therefore three women aren't raped? Well, I don't get to decide complex issues like that? Is it better for four women to be raped once each or one woman to be raped four times and three to be able to walk away? I don't know. Those are disgusting, horrible things to think about. Uh, and I don't know what the morally correct answer is. I, if I'm not involved in it, I feel like I'm absolved somewhat. Um, but I think about that for, for people who have petitions against the government. Hey, uh, here's a petition to so that my wife doesn't have to stay in prison. Well, if I sign the petition, I'm legitimizing the process by saying, hey, government, I'm writing to you in the format that you asked and asking you pretty please, I recognize that you're in control. I'm asking you pretty please let this woman out of prison. Well, that's not, I mean, is that good? I, I don't know. And, and I'm really, truly, I'm not, not just saying these things to say I have a good answer. This is what I struggle with because the, the pragmatic and the really sticking to the principles I'm having trouble finding the, the correct answer here. So yeah, please keep giving feedback and your thoughts. Um, I don't know what the correct answer is in this case.